Good morning. We have a few rescues this week. Uh, this one that we're doing this morning is a tractor. It's been sitting a while. It is a diesel and I don't know anything about it. I've never even seen one in person. I've only heard of them. So waiting on the Iceman to get here. We're about to hop in the truck. So let's get started. What's going on everybody? Hope you all had a happy Easter. Just waiting on the Iceman to get here, grabbing a few things. And uh, yeah, the uh, tractor we're going after today, it's on a ranch that's uh, going up for sale or just sold. And uh, this little tractor's been sitting there and Iceman was out there doing a uh, metal scrap haul off and the uh, gentleman said, Hey, take that tractor with you. Uh, it's a Hinomoto. I, I've heard of them. I've never seen one in person. I've never worked on one, but it's a little two cylinder diesel, which would be great for around here, moving stuff around or even mowing by, by my, uh, excuse me, back pasture. So we're gonna go rescue this thing. Uh, it's not worth going to scrap if it's, uh, if it's a runner, it's worth more <laughs> as a little diesel tractor, especially for the stuff we do around here. So this week we're starting off with that one. Uh, we've got two other rescues. One of them I'm super stoked about. I can't wait to show you guys that one, but it's, uh, it's got some history behind it. Uh, we'll just say the truck that, well, I don't know if you call it a truck. What it is, anyways, it started off in California uh, back in its heyday and uh, has slowly crept its way out this way and so we're rescuing that one too and the other cool part about uh, that video is we're going to get to show you another car graveyard from a uh, friend of me and Iceman's. Uh, he's got quite the collection uh, interesting odd cool stuff laying around that one, I'm going to be sharing some of his info with you because a lot of it, most of it is for sale. And of course I can't take all of it. So we're going to be sharing his info. So when we do that video, we'll show you what he's got and give you some contact info. That way, if you see anything out there you want to buy and come get, you can hit him up. But let me finish grabbing everything we need to go do this tractor rescue and that way we can uh, hop in the truck and get over there to it because we got to be there in like 30 minutes. So we'll tune back in when we're in the truck with ice. He's as cold as ice. <laughs> got ice band and a little Muppet hiding back there in the back seat. We're uh, about to pull up to this ranch. Uh, is he going to be here? Hey, yeah, he's supposed to meet us. He's supposed to meet us. Okay. I don't know if we're going to catch him on camera or not, but uh, to be polite, we probably won't shove a camera in his face, <laughs> but we're going to uh, get out here and see if we can get this uh, tractor loaded. It does have a uh, shredder behind it, so we got to get that up on the trailer too. Not a problem. <laughs> no, nah, not with this guy. He'll, it'll, he'll just follow the tractor. Yeah, in one or two pieces, but it'll it'll get on there. We can take it in two. <laughs> God, it's a bumpy road. Oh, this is the, this is the smooth part. <laughs> great he shouldn't have taken us down this road we turned as soon as we turned down this road i looked over and i'm like oh cool an old jeep and then there under this old carport was a chevelle just sitting there rotting and i'm like okay i'm gonna turn have around. to turn gonna around. have to turn around yeah we're gonna have to go hand out some business cards yeah but maybe all right anyway. <laughs> we'll uh we'll tune back in whenever we get here and see if we uh see what we're dealing with oh cattle guard he's seen this thing i haven't i've only saw i saw a picture that he sent me but uh Oh, there's yeah. an old, that's an old El Camino. Very old. I like this road. All right, we'll tune in uh, 
back in when we get there. In this case Mike breaks something, we want to catch it on video. Well, give me a chance to sit down anyway. <laughs> Turn the wheel. Yeah, you have to drive it up yourself. I think I will. <laughs> if they were all this easy, that'd be great. Yeah, we wouldn't have all the customers. <laughs> I guess that's gonna work. You're, you'll be right on the, yeah. the edge of it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, you got it. Huh? That's for mowing. That was a little too easy. Go ahead and see if it could jump up on there. Let's see if it will. You're you're sliding right up. Well, taking a ramp with you, but <laughs> as long as it goes that way. Yeah, exactly. Oh yeah. Yeah, sliding right up. I just don't want to get home right. It's got a skid on it. You should be all right. Okay. Yeah, look at that. Like a glove. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> camera one, camera two, camera one, camera two. Too early for the little one. <laughs> it's probably uh, got a sugar sugar high still from Easter. Uh, all right. I found the real one. Oh, the old real ones too? Yeah, she got real eggs too. <laughs> None of them fake ones. Huh? Well, for some reason that went a lot easier. Yeah. yeah, very fast and a lot easier than what we anything else we've touched lately yeah no that's that was in and out in like five minutes it was just hook up roll on leave Bye. Bye. <laughs> so all right it's on the back of the trailer we're going to take uh the smooth ish. route smooth ish, smooth -ish yes. route back there you go and uh we'll see if we can get it off the trailer that oh. might be where we run into the fun part so we'll tune back in when we get to the house and after we've enjoyed some much needed tacos mm -hmm. taco time we are back at the garage, kind of taking a gander at this thing, and I've got to say, uh, everything is very easy access to work on this thing. But one thing we did notice is there's some coolant down there. So this radiator's leaking somewhere. Hole in one. We'll figure it out. Nothing else, we'll just throw some bar stop leak or something in there. But we got a uh, Iceman's contraption here. This old rope was uh, already hooked up, so it's probably old and decrepit and gonna break but the got it anchored off to Loretta over here we're just gonna uh, drag, it off. drag it off so I guess uh, is it in neutral <laughs> close that hood too or the bonnet that way it uh, don't slam down on us I don't need that. <laughs> but no it's a it's a little rusty and crusty but underneath the hood man it's a this clean ain't rusty and crusty ain't that us yeah that's us yeah if it wasn't rusty and crusty we would probably wouldn't be touching it yeah, that's right. they want to sell it to you but no we'll, we'll clean it up a little bit put some fresh paint and some of those rusty spots and make it look pretty again i bet it'll it'll run it's a it's a diesel i'm just glad it's a uh, japanese and not chinese but these were popular little tractors back in the late 70s, uh, early 80s. So I don't know. I haven't run the number yet. See what year it is. But it's gonna. I'm, I'm going to guess between 78 and 82. It's probably right in that range. It, it don't, oh, did you see how many hours are on it? I didn't even check. Uh, I didn't. Let's see. How many hours we got? Hours, 725. That's not very many. No. It's, it's not bad at all. Huh. Custom exhaust. Yeah. They took this piece and <laughs> yeah. Welded if that is a glass pack, glass pack that, straight down the ground, they just downpipe. <laughs> <laughs> that should sound pretty good, we'll but in a minute. well, hopefully. I don't know what that switch is. Can't read it. Uh, is there a year model down here? I, uh, I didn't see one. No, I'll have to run this uh, serial number and see. What it comes back at? Yeah, we'll run this later. Figure out what year it is. Some of that I can't read. It's in Japanese. 
but we can uh they've got they've got apps for that i can just take a picture of it and say translate this but uh no i think it's gonna be good especially for when we got to mow back there in the back field what are y'all doing yeah. <laughs> what what'd you find a washer you ready? Oh, they're all over the place. All right, Riley, uh, come over here if you're going to stand here or stand stand somewhere safe. He's about to drag that off. So you need to move. <laughs> ice, ice, Iceman's playing, and uh, we know we know what happens. All right. Did you put it in neutral? Did you put it in neutral? Yes. Okay. There it goes. <laughs> slow down, slow down. That's kind of a spring-loaded rope. It's gonna bounce it pretty good. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> uh, Oh, this isn't sketchy at all. Um, hold on, let me put you guys down for a second. <laughs> One more. <laughs> it's off. I think that tire just reseated itself. Okay, it's off. So next step is uh, see if we can make this thing run. All right, I'm sure this battery's probably half dead, but. that ground cable long enough <laughs> can't wear my boots and hat I ain't going oh <laughs> that one is probably going to need some WD or something it's... that even smells like coolant it is coolant it is coolant wow I thought it was just a water can no sparks well, that means nothing's touching well, if you're going to run something, might as well run that, right? I'll turn the key on, see if we got anything up here. Yep, we got a red light. Oh, yeah, this one should have... Oh, it's pretty good leak. I don't... Oh, is it? That's pretty good one. Where's it coming from? Right side over here by me. Uh, it looks like the actual radiator itself. Like the seam? No, like at the bottom. We have to, like, tank. Please? Yeah, we might have to take it. I'll have to take that off. See if we can patch it. <laughs> JB weld or something. Maybe we'll see where it's coming from too. Let's see. I don't know. Is it turned? Where was that? That's not going to do anything but kill the fuel pump. Um, oh, maybe you got to be on it, and maybe it's got safety features. I, I don't know. I think of something this old. I don't know. I'm not hearing nothing. Hang on. Slow throttle, slow fast. Keep turn the, uh, the key on, kind of mess with the battery. To see if it kind of does something. Nothing? No. Yeah, I'm not getting nothing over here. What is, uh. uh that's not break, that's probably clutch. I was looking at what that is. That goes to the fuel pump, so that's the manual throttle. <laughs> oh, okay, I got it. So that's what that is. I don't see a kill switch anywhere. Other than when he showed us. Yeah, we might have to. Maybe we, can, we can always jump it, jump the starter. Oh yeah, we can just arc it right here. Screw it or what? Yeah, that is really coming out of there. Where, how do you want to go? Uh, you'll go from. Let's see, that. that's your activator. So you'll go from here to here. Key on. Keys on. Okay, scoop. Scared me for a second. 
may have to get a screwdriver. I hear hissing at the front. Did you hear it? Yeah, I heard something. It might be the battery. All right, let me uh, pop the starter, see if that does it. It looks like it might have been leaking for a while. Right there, look, you see it pouring out right there. Okay. From the bottom of the radiator. At least the starter's right here. Yeah, easy to hit it. Yeah, <laughs> or change it. Yeah, really? That's a big starter too. <laughs> Diesel. We need to check, make sure this engine's not seized up. That's the other thing. Yeah, yeah. but it won't spin. It's not going to start. You mm. said you have to take all that guards off. I was just going to see if I could. Oh, oh boy. It's just the fan going to turn. Oh, no, we don't take guards off. It's right here. Uh, we got to find a socket that big. Hang on, let me, let me get my box. Yeah, get your box. Let's make sure it's not seized up first. Yeah, we might uh, get that. Yeah, I, don't, I mean, I don't see any reason why it would be everything is very I mean, all it. yeah and everything's very protected under here but we don't know why it was just parked <laughs> if that's what it was Ugh. yeah it just looks like i mean for actually for a diesel engine this is very clean you have to do it on the other side you got a guard right here I gotta do it over here. What about Jared? Jared, it is Jared. <laughs> uh, I don't think any of those sockets are gonna be big enough. Is it big, big? Yeah. Oh, oh, well, it is a pretty good size one. Biggest one I got is gonna be a 19 or 7 8. 11 16 maybe. As big as I got in here. Oh, we are much bigger than that. <laughs> It's going, it's Japanese, so should be metric. Yeah, we're going to be pulling that radiator out if we get it actually to run. Half inch drive? I don't know yet. Oh. I'm just trying a random socket. That one yeah. might at least tell us if it's going to turn. Or not. Yeah. I don't know if my cheater pipe is going to fit on the end of that. And I got a feeling you're going to need one. Oh, uh oh. Uh oh. Right row. Two hands? Oh, that's not good. <laughs> my, might be why it's sitting. <laughs> you got a pipe to put on it? It's uh, trying to move. I think mine are all too small um, to fit over the end of that. Let's pop these uh, injectors off. What, do you, what size wrench you need for that? Uh, I need, well, I gotta take the, the fuel lines off first. Let's get the fuel lines off. That looks like a 5 eighths. Uh, no, it's going to be metric. Yeah, it's metric. Um, <laughs> 15? <laughs> 17. 16 is the biggest I got. Let's try 16. 17. <laughs> 17. Check it out, I got an extra. Because sometimes I use a 17. <laughs> Yeah, let's get these fuel injectors pulled and we'll uh see what's going on. Yeah. Get some fluid down in these cylinders. Yeah, a little diesel. Then I left my tank on the ground over there because we can pour some in the hole. Oh, I need to I wish I had some acetone, we'd make some sauce put in here. That would be some stuff. With tight lines. Alright. Is it wet? What? Uh yeah, there's diesel in the, yeah, there's diesel in both of them actually. Huh. All right, now I need a, a big one to get the injector out. Bigger than what I got now? I'll uh, grab a crescent. I got one too, Brian. <laughs> you have a crescent? In the truck. Oh, no, mine's right here. Oh, okay. All right, I brought you guys around this side. That way you could actually see what we're doing. What's the surgery? <laughs> that was easy. Yeah, they should be. They better be, right? <laughs> Left side. That looks pretty dry. Well, there is there is diesel right there though. Yeah. Got some buildup. 
until that pump starts working. It should be dry or dry-ish. Keep them, keep them correct position. Morning. Okay. Um, Should I fire it over now? No, let's. Uh, let me put some blaster down in there. Engine in the engine. That's alright, we gotta clean this thing up anyways. Uh I wonder if we should uh since that's kinda hard to Well we, yeah, we could try a hmm. Maybe we'll try a pry bar. Take take that, make sure it fits over the end of it. What? The end of the the drive. What do you mean? Do you, do you, I mean I have a look, red look. one? No, I got one right here. It'll fit. Got one in the pit. Yep. Right. Put a little oomph on this thing, see if we can get it to bust loose. It was somewhat moving. You wanted to a little Yeah. Alright. There's so many things in the way right here. Nope. Don't bust your ankle or your, your knuckle, man. <laughs> Tightening the bolt. <clears throat> so what's moving? The bolt. <laughs> the bolt was loose. The then? center, no, it just put that much torque on it. Oh. Uh, tell you what, let's uh, let's pull this starter off. Then we can use the teeth of the flywheel with a pry bar and walk see if it, we can. Kind of walk it yeah, back. see if we can walk it. That's the way I did that other track, that uh, that nine end tractor I worked on. That's going to be like a thirteen or fifteen somewhere in there. You want one of them big pry bars with the angled tip on it? Uh, yeah, we'll probably, well, not the largest one, probably the middle one. one. Down from it? Yeah, it should be laying on the floor. On the floor? Yeah, right in front of the toolbox. I was using it. What is that? That's, uh, oh. I'm gonna get that nest out of here. <laughs> behind the starter? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Let's see. Um, get this out of the way where it's not going to touch anything. Um, actually, go ahead and take the positive cable off. Yeah, just in, case. just in case. We're not going to be using this for a minute anyways. What are you doing? <laughs> it's not on there that bad. <laughs> you know, bad enough could take it off like <laughs> Okay. All right, let's let that hang, hang there. right there. And let's see if we can get a on a tooth here. <laughs> Right there. Oh boy. Right row. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, the head's coming off. I don't want to do that. I know, but it ain't moving. <laughs> I don't even see a little bit of it. Oh no, it's got, it's, it, it's kind of trying to, but. Don't let that thing slip off. Not on camera. <laughs> oh. Hey, it moved. Holy crap. Hey, there we go. That. There we go. We might be okay because that's all like that. Like a boom, and then it was moving. Yeah. Way easier than before. All right, we had some stuck rings there. Put yeah, look at that. Back in there now. Yeah, look at that. Well, we're cooking with diesel now. Well, let me get. Let me see if I can get a full turn. Yeah, try to. Yo, that's real smooth. Oh, it's like butter now. Yeah. <laughs> you just had to break it loose. Oh, you know what it is. The connecting rods just disconnected from the piston, so. Yeah. <laughs> no. Oh, well, don't say that. <laughs> God, I hope not. <laughs> I'll be like, put it back on the trailer. Take the oh, there's a hard spot. Harder. That's a little crunchy. Yep, it went on by it. Yeah. So, when not that big a deal? Oh, I'd love to hear this thing run before I took it off. That'd be yeah, I know. You're never here for the, I'm never here for the, that. the startup part. I get to, all I get to do is watch the video like everybody else. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Never here for the action. I'm always that I fan. I think we're probably good. I'm always that fan sitting there going, oh, is it going to go? And then <laughs> the leaves start flying. You go, yep, there it went. <laughs> okay. I think we're good there. Uh, now we'll find out if the starter works.
going to have to jump it, though. Uh, did I tell you about the screwdriver piece, that yellow-handled one? Right here in your trunk. Oh, I was going to... Oh, that works, too. No, a connection. I saw a spark. Tighter, go ahead. I need something better than the wrench. Here, let's try this again. Try using the back size of the interrupt teeth. Hey, that was blaster to the face again. <laughs> Them glasses are gonna need a good wipe down when you're done. <laughs> yeah, I think I, du I ducked out pretty good. It didn't get me in the eye. It just I got the. Why it made me move to this side of the tractor? That's so weird that I came over. Well, here. I kind of have to be over here. Well, you're on the dangerous end of it. Just look. Three D. <laughs> Can you just nail the diesel? <laughs> No, that's uh, all blaster. Yeah, I can smell it. Oh, that's in my hair. No, oh, that's in everything. <laughs> oh. You know why they call it PB Blaster? This is when the the, 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 the subscribers and watchers. Yeah, this is what the where's your used. Where's your safety glasses? Oh, yeah. That wouldn't have <laughs> happened if you didn't have glasses on. It would have happened if you just would have had it on the glasses. I got a little burn in that one. Oh, come on now. It'll go away. It'll go away. I don't thought I'd hold it back. I'll let you start that one. Now we gotta figure out why the key's not working though. Oh, I thought you had to turn it on. No, no, I meant that to start it. The signal wire. See, we protected the viewers. We made sure it was just on video. <laughs> Didn't get on your TV, you're fine. <laughs> <laughs> no need to get scared. Does that turn or not? Does that now that's blowing or going that way. That should be right here. You may have to take it off and start it at the threads where they where they end up there. They start at the same spot no matter what. So why would it be? I don't know. We need new lines anyways. I'm not gonna worry about that. Well, don't these just sit on there? I want to know what this switch is. Lights maybe. It might be lights. I bet there's nothing else up there. And whatever that is, it's gone. Yeah, I think the ignition might be out. Oh, that's for your glow plugs. So you would hold, oh yeah, right there it says it. You would oh, hold. it does have glow plugs. Right there. Yeah, one and two. Uh, where's the starter wire go? Let's see if it's just... Pinched or cut? It's... It comes all the way over this side? It's up in here. I wonder if it's just... I don't know. Well, for right now, we'll just... Do what we're doing? Yeah. Where'd your uh, blade go? Oh, right here. Oh. Let's see if we get. Uh... Oh, I see. Yeah, we got fuel. Yeah, we got diesel coming out. All right. Dang. What was that? <laughs> I better check it out. <laughs> you good, Riley? <laughs> <laughs> We're good. <laughs> that was uh, what size was that? Oh, 17. It's a submit box. Oh. Jared, is that Jared coming over here on a scooter? He sees me over here playing with tractors, yeah, you might. Yeah, know what showed up now. <clears throat> no, he went the other way. Yeah, they just got back from camping, I guess. Yeah. Um, I guess you could throw a little uh, ether in there. Uh, we gonna take this cap off? Yeah. I, it might suck it in from there. Is it on the left side? Huh? Uh, it's on the bench or somewhere over there on that side. Let's put the jump box on here real quick. So that part of the air compressor, but it has a little plug in? Yeah, it's a... Yeah. Jump box. Too funny. Yeah, it's a... Should be over there still. As long as I don't leave without it. Lights on, yeah. Oh. Hit it, hit it. Hang on. Hold on, see what... Uh, throttle. 
Give it some, yeah. Okay, I'll give it a little bit more throttle. Okay, when you're ready. Go ahead. Come on, baby. Oh, I lost power. Hang on. No, I, th I think one of those cables is loose. Because I lost all power. Okay, try that. No, I mean, the actual terminals. One of those is loose. It might be that ground. Yeah, that's loose. Yeah, pop that sucker on there a little bit. There you go. Yeah, we got a solid red light now. Okay. okay go again. Go. All right. It almost kicked off. That yeah. was too funny. Yeah, it's getting there. All right, ready? Go ahead. It's trying. It's trying really I, We hard. need we need some more oomph yeah, behind yeah, this yeah. thing. Oh, uh, you want me to turn my truck around and see if we can... Yeah, it's kind of loud, though. I'm trying to think if I've got another battery sitting here that's fully charged. Um, uh, well, we could, I could turn the truck off. We don't, we don't need that. Oh, yeah, we don't need that much. That's true. Diesel. All right, we are back with a... Diesel leak. <laughs> we have a diesel leak, too? Yeah, right here. Where's that coming from? It's Tank? It's coming right out of the bottom of the oil filter. I mean, the fuel filter. Oh, well, we can, that's easy fix. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Another fuel filter. <laughs> <laughs> well, we got a clean lens and a fresh battery on this camera, so we're going to uh, jump back on this, and we also have old blue hooked up, <laughs> so we got more power. Let's uh, try this again. Oh, uh, uh, I got some spray here if we need some. Lights on. Lights uh, on. Let's see how much oomph we got now. Got smoke out of it, so that's a good sign. Yeah, we're getting pinhole smoke over here. Okay. Out of, out of a little pinhole. I don't know what that is. Uh, oh, we have. That's. That's. Like he said, pull it to kill it, push it to run it. Is that right? That's what he showed me. Pull it to kill it? Pull it to kill it, push it to. We can try it both ways. I could have. Heard it wrong. It was early and I hadn't had a talk to <laughs> Let's, I let's, hear right let's try it right there and see what it does. Go, go, go. Out to run. PTO. Which one's the? Oh, that's no, oh, that's PTO. This one. Yeah, there it is. Hydraulics are working. Is everything clear from underneath? Oh, 
Oh yeah, that's right. I'll wait on that. What is that one? That goes to the fuel pump. Move it? No, not this one. The fuel pump's right there. This is a... Uh... Oh, that might be a parking brake. Hydraulics work, that's awesome. Yeah, we gotta get air in these tires so we can actually try it out. No temp gauge? Not yet. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that temp gauge don't work. Well, we'll get a hook up the airlines. Oops. Yeah, let's see how let's see how low it idles. That's really good. Per kitty per. No kidding. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, that was easy. So I guess we'll move on to uh, see if we get air in these tires and let's see if it actually moves and operates. So. You want one of my ratchet straps? You gonna kill it? Yeah, I'm gonna kill it. We'll be right back. All right, since the tires are off the bead, if you've never seen this before, this is a redneck trick. <laughs> yeah, I do the same thing. Tighten it down till it squeezes that and then throw some air in it. Let me make sure, where's the valve? Okay. It's on the inside? Yeah, it's right here. Right. Okay. That should do it. We'll see. If not, put some more pressure on it. Oh. I need to come around. It's in a bad spot. No, oh, the handle's in the way. There no, you go. I just need to <laughs> let it down. All right, let's see if it takes it. Do it. I'm it back nope. Here. A little bit more. Riley, hand me that squirt bottle, Bubby. There's some soapy water in there. See some on this back side. Yeah, I kind of cleaned it off a minute ago. Go for it, go for it. Tighter, yeah, I like it. Is it right there? Yeah, but it's not tight enough. Oh, tighten there's it up. A, there's a huge hole right there. Try that. Oh. There it goes, there it goes, there it goes. Come on, you fool. Get on there. I don't think it's taking it. It's starting to. Don't go too far, I'm hooked up. <laughs> Lighter or what? Yeah, you got one? I got one. Huh? Oh, I got one. Okay. Well, we need to get. Gotta be able to get up in it. I don't, need, I don't need none on here. You might. It's windy. Yeah. Okay. Don't do it too close. Do you not try this at home? No. Don't even try it in the garage. Oh, you just set it on fire. <laughs> that didn't work. <laughs> well, we wanted the tire to get warm. Well, that's true. Let's put some air in it real quick. While the tires are on fire? Uh huh. <laughs> oh, I know who's gonna give us heck about it being on fire. Oh, there you go, there you go. Dude. Come on, get on there. Pop, pop. Yeah, really. Come on. Why aren't you taking? Yeah. I thought it was going to go. I did too. You want to do it again? Or? Yeah, the problem is, is we have to be able to get it. More it needs, it. Yeah, it's, there's, there's not enough space in there, so it didn't it didn't create a, uh, no boom a bubble. Yeah. We're just going to take the tires off, take them to the tire shop, and let them do it. All right, Iceman has returned. Got, got the... Uh, <laughs> got air. Got air in the tires, finally. Put some snot on them to make sure they sealed up. Now we got uh, got the old trigger hooked up here, so I guess Mike's going to do the honors, find out if this thing moves or not. Oh, right, 
gas center just right yeah, there yeah. we go just right all right let's see you're good is that you said it yeah you just pop it in, in, in and then on. uh <laughs> that easy here leave that uh up there out of the way yeah all right all right let me get out of your way so i don't get run over <laughs> Make sure the brakes work. <laughs> oh yeah. Try uh try the PTO. Yeah, stay over there. There it goes. Oh, that's scary. Oh, hey, you're throwing stuff. <laughs> All right, now that we are running and moving, Iceman went and grabbed us some... Uh, a puppy filter. Yeah, we got a little filter we're gonna put. <laughs> new fuel filter on it. Oil looks like diesel oil. It feels good, it looks good. Uh, air filter is... Looks like an air filter. It looks, well, it looks new, so it was probably serviced not long ago. And we're gonna try some just old-fashioned stop leak in the radiator because trying to find that exact radiator, I looked it up and it's not real easy to find. Probably um, too. It's, uh, I found one, it was like 260, 280 for that small bucks. Radiator? Yeah, for that little oh dinky God. radiator. There's not so, that much radiator there. Get some fuel in the filter, get that changed out, and put some stop leak in it, top it off with coolant, and then we're going to see shred. if this thing Fruit will shred. actually shred. We'll go hit the back field back there. and probably just do. That's not my property. I ain't doing their property. That's, well, just do the county favors? Yeah, I'm not doing the county any favors. They don't do us any favors. <laughs> we're going we're gonna to go back and hit the back of my pasture where I've never mowed because my uh i don't want to take my good riding mower down there there's a lot of rocks you do that you got to put it back on my trailer <laughs> yeah 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 that, yeah because my good riding mower actually came off his trailer something uh, it was a mower somebody threw away so all right let's get this uh changed out real quick and then we'll uh put some stop leak in it and cool it and then we'll fire this thing up and uh Dang, give it a real crazy. test oh, my God, oh that's man. that's rust i know that's what it, it was it was uh, right there is why the engine was seized up <laughs> there was water in the tank oh that's that you can't even see through that yeah you can see the bottom of this filter the fuel bowl actually doesn't look too bad but yeah there's Dirty, a good clean <laughs> yeah no rust and no rust <laughs> all right we'll be back if he makes this you won't know because it's not gonna be on uh, camera be behind it oh perfect went right in <laughs> Yeah, no. <laughs> Not talk about it. It didn't work because I wasn't throwing it at the trailer. Let's see. Let's um. I'm gonna fire it up. Yeah, it's good. Let them ponies run. Cycling that air bubble out. People throw things away like that. <laughs> Should have have him on the road this week. Finally got the title situation figured out, so we'll finally uh, get back uh, to working on Clyde. Got to get uh, metal work done on the rocker panels and all that kind of stuff. But all right, let's get this gate open. We'll try out the shredder.
What are you doing? <laughs> come on, come here. <laughs> I smell coolant. Yeah. I really. You want to get it, Bubby? Really hope that stop leak works because, uh, yeah, trying to find that radiator. There's not a lot of Hinamoto parts out there. Go ahead, Bubby. Yeah, I can see it bowing. We definitely got to do some. Yeah, we got to do some welding back there. <laughs> some more welding. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Watch your tail. <laughs> Mike, Mike, huh? No, 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 do it down there. Up, 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 up. Riley, watch out, hey. Crazy kid. The blades are a little bent. Oh! Killed some dirt for me. You have the PTO in high? You need it in two. Yeah, put it, put it all, yeah, that way it spins faster. And then run that in low and then RPM's up. In first right now. Yeah, in first. Make sure you're in low, which is uh, middle. And then run your RPM. You want your RPMs up there. I just want to drag the trailer. Right? Yeah, don't do that. <laughs> yeah, you already tilled it. There you go. Really low. Crank it. Definitely gonna have to rebuild that shredder. It's got uh, it's got some weak points in it, metal missing, and everything else. But it's uh it's working. You have to probably sharpen the blades too. Yeah, that rock ended up <laughs> over there. <laughs> it's 
probably that blowing out. It's, it's definitely slowed down a lot. Oh, it was pouring out. Yeah, it was pouring out before. We'll let it, we'll let it sit here and run a little bit. Let it chew it up. Yeah, let it, let it get hot and swole and yeah, there we go. And this morning it was seized up. It went from dead tractor to a, it's alive again. <laughs> and it sounds good. Oh, the overflow is spitting too. Yeah, well, it's all the way to the top. Yeah, okay. Sure it starts to spin, it yeah. picks it up. Yeah, and well, that we don't know if it, how good the thermostat is in this thing, too. So, all right. We will, uh, what are you doing? We'll uh, tune back in here in a few minutes and uh, close out this video. She's a runner. Now I gotta go find something else. <laughs> What's, oh. next? What's next? <laughs> oh, we got it. We just gotta figure out what day you're available oh, to go get. It. Now, I... Oh, we'll be kicking. I forgot. Didn't know we couldn't say it. <laughs> I'm giving them to Clark. That's what we can't do live. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't no good at secrets. <laughs> yeah, Ice Man can't keep secrets. He about, he about told you what we were gonna go get this week. I'm saving that one for a surprise. <laughs> but, uh, all right. Well, that's alive and kicking and luckily for right now at least the uh coolant leak has stopped we'll uh get around to it later and patch <laughs> patch the shredder up or find another one i'm sure at some point somebody's probably gonna throw one on ice man's trailer <laughs> maybe yeah usually funny thing is is a lot of times i will tell him hey if you happen to run across this i need one or i'm looking for it a lot of times it's on his trailer that day he'll just come by and he'll be like hey it's there it is is what you looking for <laughs> this one we weren't expecting this was uh this was lucky and we got real lucky easy to load seized engine unseized pretty much fired right off once driving. we figured out how the fuel pump lever works yeah. running driving shredding running driving shredding so yeah we got we got real lucky with this one it's gonna be useful we're gonna use this one for one doing our field and two pulling stuff off my pulling head. stuff around well not just that i got a lot of cars to move around, around. <laughs> we got, got, a, got a car car lot over here going yeah. and we got more stuff coming this week so but all right we'll be back in a few minutes okay i think that's going to wrap up this video that went a lot easier than i thought it would uh that means the next one's probably gonna gonna bite but uh yeah uh, hope everyone's having a fantastic April Fools. I was going to play a joke on you, but eh, it is what it is. I'm not in the mood. <laughs> I'm worn out. It's been a long month. But uh, yeah, we're doing another rescue this week. One I'm really excited about. Uh, 
it's got some history behind it. It's very cool. Um, so we're going to get that, and uh, it's one I've never seen in person before, so when I saw it, I, I worked out a deal on it. So we're going to go check out that graveyard when we go get that one, see what else he's got, what he's got for sale. And uh, yeah, don't forget, uh, if you haven't seen it and you're not on our uh, Graveyard Facebook page, the contest is running for that uh, Android car stereo system. Uh, so all you got to do is go uh, watch that video on the Facebook page and you enter in the comments on that. And uh, yeah, going to uh, now uh, hop back on uh, getting Thanos running, getting it finished up so we can deliver that. And yeah, so hope everyone's, uh, I hope everyone had a fantastic Easter and a good April Fool's. Watch out and uh, we will see you in the next video.